Good evening. Good evening. Welcome to our soda taste test challenge. Um, so we got our sodas at FYE. Um, we got some at Dollar Tree. I keep wanting to say Dollar General. <laughs> um, Cracker Barrel yep. and our friend John. Thank you, John. You have provided us with many sodas, and we have many more to come from you. So, thank you, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So, tonight, we are going to do the following. Say it with me. We are going to smell, smell it, it, taste it, rate it. it. And then, we're going to talk about our least favorite and our most now, favorite. Now, we may ha have the same favorites and least favorites, or we may not. You never know. And it's okay, no matter what our opinion is, as long as we don't get into a fight. <laughs> we all are friends here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> moving right. on from this pep Moving talk. on. So, I'm excited because we have some sour flavors, which I love sour. We both love sour. Yeah. But then we have one that we're like, ooh. Uh, yeah. Butter. Butter. So all I gotta say is butter. Okay. All right. Moving on. So, our first flavor of the evening is Shrek. Sour Swamp Soda. It says it is by DreamWorks, like the movie company. And it is um, sour apple. So we're going to smell it. I can smell the apple. What about you? It has the smell of apple cider. Mm. And I love apple cider. Apple cider is one of my favorite things. Yeah, that's odd. I smell the apple, but when I taste it, I taste some sourness. And then the apple is like an afternote. So, hmm. I thought I would like really love that, but I'm not. Yeah, I. <clears throat> man, my voice is trying to go away. I agree with her. It, um, at first it just has a fizzy and a sourness. And then it, after you have swallowed it and your throat has had a second to process it and your taste buds have, it tastes like apples. I can't understand. I don't understand it. I can't explain it. All right, so what would you rate Shrek Sour Swamp Soda on a scale of 1 to 10? Honestly, it's really good, though, so I'd give it an 8. I'm going to give it a 3. All right. Seriously? I didn't much care for it. All right, the next one is by Boots. Beverage Company. Beverage Company. It is Coconut Cream Coconut Soda. Coconut Cream Soda. So when he first opened this earlier... <laughs> thought that came to my mind was when I was a teenager we would <coughs> lay out in the sun and put on sun tanning lotion or oil to try and get tanned which never ever worked. It smells like. And that's what like, this smells like. It smells like lotion. Okay. It smells Here good. we go. Let's see I if it tastes like lotion. lotion. I hope not. That's good. It tastes like fizzy coconut water. It's actually I've really good. I've never had coconut water. It's really good. All right. Tastes like a um, coconut popsicle. popsicle. Yeah, coconut popsicle. You read my or mind. Like a pina colada, pina colada, icy or something like that. So I am actually going to give this one like a nine because I really liked it. I'm going to give it a seven. A seven. I couldn't think about my numbers. All right, so Boots, you, we are a fan of your soda, uh -huh. or at least that soda. All right, this one is an interesting one. Um, it is called. Uh, it is by. RCB, it is Nuclear Orange Bomb. Nuclear Orange Bomb. Yeah. I expect this to be shockingly sour. It says terrorizing taste, and I think it's probably because of the label, but anyway, we expect it to be really sour, and um, he's right. We were trying to look for, like, the bottling information, and we see RBC as the company, so... It smells like super powerful orange, like woohoo orange. Wow. <laughs> That's really orangey, isn't it? Yeah. All right. Oh. For as powerful as it smelled, I expected it to taste like really, really powerful. It is bubbling up an awful lot, though. Maybe that's the bomb part of it. That's so. Hmm. Um, okay. So initially, when you first get the taste, it to me it tastes like an orange dreamsicle, mm. and then after you initially you get your first taste. taste, the aftertaste yeah, is not, not good. Yeah. It, yeah, 
words can't describe it. it <laughs> it's just weird. It was good at first, yeah. but then the aftertaste kind of did away with okay, that. Okay, so, so what would you rate I'm it? actually going to give it a three. I'd say four. Okay. Next one is Jones Soda. So now, Ethan has a cool so story about this. So there is, so a while back I was in my room doing stuff on my iPad and I searched Jones Soda. And it took me to their website, and you can vote for these labels that will be on the bottles. I voted for this very label. And then I went to Dollar Tree a few days later, and there it was. So he voted for the Berry Lemonade Soda to have this particular car on the label. And apparently that one won, so he thought it was really cool. Ooh, it smells like blue slushy. Blue slushy. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's sour. Like, pucker is all I get. And I like sour, but... Wow. Okay. Uh, so, rate that one. One that to ten. That tastes like a blue raspberry warhead. Yuck. That? Four. I'm going to give it like a two, because I just wasn't impressed. And normally, I like it. All right. Our next one. This one we're kind of geeked up about, because just the name alone... It is by the Orca Beverage Company. Brownie Caramel Cream Root Beer. Lots of our favorite things in that title. That I love name. brownies, I love chocolate, and I love caramel. Okay. And we love root beer. It has a chocolatey root beery smell. It does. It smells to me it smells like a chocolate soda. Alright, I'm gonna taste. We did a chocolate soda. If you remember that, put it in the comments. I taste caramel. And maybe a hint of chocolate. Hmm. It's not bad. It's, it's not just not bad, exactly it's what not I was great. expecting. It's okay. not bad, but it's not um, great. I am going to give this one an 8. What are you going to give this one? Uh, my mind went blank. 6. A 6. All right. And the last one. The dreaded one. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Dun. It's supposed to be the lower dun. one because it's... There we go. Butter soda. Butter. This says it is by the Rocket Fizz Soda Pop and Candy Shop. They do cinnamon. So, when I was little, I used to eat butter and bread sandwiches, and I had a special name for it. Bring bread. That's exactly what I said. I'm just too old to do it now, but he can still do it. So, I think about butter, and I'm like, yeah, I like butter. And he drowns his baked potatoes, like, ridiculously. Like... The amounts of butter I put on my potatoes. So, we think we like butter, uh -huh. but as we found out with the ranch soda, we love ranch, but we sure did not love the uh -huh. ranch soda. So, butter soda it is, and you get to do the honors. Actually, when we had the ranch soda, we were fighting for the bathroom because we needed okay. to get rid okay. of it. Okay, okay, let's just move on It that. smells like the ranch and the mustard soda. And see, I just barely smell anything. It just, I just barely You're smell You're tasting anything. first. Oh, I'm tasting first. Oh, gosh, thank you. Ladies first. Beauty before fleas. Oh. Like Tastes what they like... say in Grinch, fleas before beauty, except yes. dip -dopped. That to me kind of tastes like sweet corn with butter I and a soda sweet... flavor. I love kinda sweet. Kind of fizzy. I lo... It's weird. I love sweet corn with butter. Yeah, but just taste that, please. Oof. All right. All right. As soon as he swallows that, we will be able to rate it. <laughs> he looks like he's shrinking. All right, so he's melting. He's melting. I'm melting. Just like the butter. Yeah, that didn't melt. I'm that... going to give that a two because that was zero. Rough. All right, so that is the end of our soda challenge tonight. Now yep. we are going to talk about our number one favorite and our my number one favorite. Oh, and then we'll do our least favorite. Yes. Uh, my number one favorite was probably the Shrek. My least favorite was the butter. Shrek, favorite. most favorite, Ethan. Butter, least favorite, moi. Butter, least favorite, least favorite. Ethan, or yeah. moi. Mm -hmm. My <laughs> number one choice was the coconut soda that I was worried would taste like suntan lotion, but it was actually really good. And my least favorite was just like Ethan's. Boom, butter. Boom, boom. Bang, bang, boom. Butter. Butter. Yuck. Yuck. All right, so we are about to sign off. So what should we say for our sign off tonight? Well, uh, we love you. We send you lots of good vibes and peace. Have a good night. Uh, we'll see you on the next one.
Hey, hey, Thanks goodbye. for watching all our craziness Thank you of for mother watching. and son. This is actually a really good thing to do with your mom. It's a good bond. So oh. any children out there that want to do something cool with their mom or dad, let us know and we can give you tips. All right. Good, good night, night, everybody. Peace out. Peace. Peace. Peace.